Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got the new Color Club Thermal Swatches, and this was requested by Queen Chaz. I've got Getting Warmer, and we're going to swatch these. On, we'll swatch some of these on my nails. I'm going to swatch like eight of them, I think. I'm going to swatch the new ones, just so you can see how they apply and the color of them. And I will be doing the temperature change in test, you know, with the water, with the hot and the cold. So we've got also... This next one is all fired up, and it's a beautiful color. I love this one. It's almost jelly-like, like a crelly. It's um, it's definitely a different formula than the first one, but it's all good. So we're going to end up doing two coats of all of these on my nails, and at the end, I will have also some comparisons of all the other colors that were in my last video that I did on these color clubs. Here we go with cold shoulder, and you know, I, I, I am going to retract some of what I said in that last video. These are not all dead on dupes. There are a couple that in my mind, if you have one, you totally do not need the other one um, as far as the new versus the old ones, and you know, but until I actually swatched them all the way out on a swatch wheel, I did not notice how similar or how different they were. Um, so I am going to retract some of this. We'll see here in a little bit. This one is Stone Cold. I mean, it's, it, they're just, these, the formulas on these are really nice. I have used these polishes, not these particular ones, but these Color Club Thermals. I have used them to stamp, and they do really well with that. So here we're going to go in with our second coat of everything. Now I'm just making a mess. Oh my goodness. Hello, Woody. Y'all will get to see Woody quite a bit in this video. Uh, sometimes I just get all excited about doing something and I just get sloppy. But these are really beautiful polishes. And, you know, if you don't own anything like this and you do run across them, they are, they are really nice. Now, this next one on my ring finger, the one that's kind of yellow and green, man, the color changing on that one is just really good. I mean, it's just doing it right here in the normal temp of the, the room. The other ones are changing some too, but they're not as noticeable. You, know, like you can see that one that's getting darker gray on the tip. You know, just room temp. And here we go. We're going to drop them in some cold water. And this makes them, to me, this makes them the more dark. And you can still see the lines a little bit from where I had them from room temp. And we're going to kind of reset them. Now we've got the lighter colors. And here I just did the tips, so you can see that they all changed pretty well. Pretty excited about them. Now we're going to go in with the other four. And this one is overheated, and that was the one that I didn't have anything similar to already in my collection. So I'm, I was pretty happy about that. And here we go with our first coat of this one. Overheated. I really do like this one. That pink and orange is just talking to me. I am ready for some pretty colors. Me and a lot of my friends here on YouTube have been chatting in the comments. The next is cool story, by the way. But we've been talking about how we're so ready for some spring and some pastels and some brights and some, you know, colors that get your attention. We're, we're, we're over the, the, you know, winter stuff. We're over it. And this one is really changing a lot, too. It's, it's really weird because as I'm brushing it, it's kind of purple, and then it immediately changed to blue up on that nail. But this one I really like. Next, we're going to do So Chill. Look at that middle one, though. Mm. And this one's pretty cool, too. This one's um, it's not as drastic of a change as the, the middle finger one, but it's, it's still a pretty polish. There we go. Got the first coat on that one. And then next, I have Total Meltdown. This is my kind of color right here. I love pink and purple nail polishes. So, we all know this one's talking to me. It's saying, hello, hello, hello. So, there we go with our first coat. And we're going to go back in and do second coats of everything. So here we go with our second coat.
and I like that one. I like all of them. Who am I kidding? I love color changing polishes. And see how that goes on? It's purple. It's purple, and then it turns blue. Sorry, the camera's acting stupid. This one was just so funny. I just thought that that was so cool. There we go. Blurry again and straighten out. But I really, really like that one. That one's just in your face changing. And you can see that ring finger one's not changing so much. We'll have to see what the cold and the hot water does with it. Maybe it'll, maybe it'll add, make it act right. We'll see. It's changing a little bit. And then this one, it's like my, my favorite, my favorite colors. So there we go. We got our second coats of everything. And I do top coat these before I do this little test. So here we go with the cold first. And look at that. And then the hot. Well, more like warm. So there we go. And then now we're going to do the halfsies. And there we go. There it is. <clears throat> Excuse me. So here we go. I've got a little swatch photo of that one. And I hope you enjoyed it. Now on to the next part of this All video. Alright, I thought I would do a quick swatch comparisons of the three that were different so that we can see how different they are on the swatch wheel compared next to each other. These are the two that are in the same bottles. This is the new one. It's um, Getting Warmer and then Old Soul. So these two are similar but different and um, different enough that I thought I would swatch them on a swatch wheel and see how they look. So here we go. Nice first coat of it. And then that's getting warmer. And here is Old Soul. Totally different polishes. And then we have the next two. The new one is Total Meltdown. And the old one is Shady Lady. Both in the same bottles, um, different names, and they're different colors. But I wanted to go ahead and swatch them side by side so you could see the differences in them. So here is the first one, which is Total Meltdown. And then the other one was Shetty Lady, I believe. Yes, Shetty Lady. And you can see one's more purple, and the other one's more got more fuchsia-looking kind of a shade to it. So there we go with those two. Totally different. And then the next two that were different was Cool Story is the new one. And Serene Green is the old one. If we can get them to focus. So there we go. Let's get the caps off of these and swatch it in. So here we go with the new one. And it's got like a dusty purple look to it, which I think is pretty cool. And that one was cool story and the next one is serene green and these are totally different colors I mean one's purple and one's kind of like a blue so they're definitely different I'm gonna go ahead and do a second swatch of these and I'll be right back okay I am back and curiosity got the better of me so I pulled out the rest of the new ones and the ones that I believed were dupes so let me just start off by saying I was wrong. I was wrong. Okay, so these are the ones that originally, the four that I said did look different. Um, we've got the first one, which is getting warmer, and then the, the one that was old soul. So we got the new one and the old one, and they're d totally different. And then next we had the new one was Total Meltdown, and the old one was Shady Lady, and they're totally different. And then next we have Cool Story and Serene Green. And we already knew those were totally different. And then the last two that, um, no. So these, these were ones that I thought were the same. So it was just three, not four. 
that I knew were totally different. But here we go. We've got Cold Shoulder was the new one. And then Shine Theory was the old one. And they're totally different. They didn't look different on the bottle caps, really. They, you know, a little bit, not nothing crazy or nothing. But on the swatch wheel, swatched out, they do totally look different. Now the grays. These are the the two that were in the gray bottles. And this is Head in the Clouds, which is the new one. And the old one was Stone Cold. There is a slight difference. This one is a little bit darker than this one. But not by much. I mean... If you've got one, I don't know that you would really need both. And then we're going to head on to the two hot pinks that were, um, we have the new one, which is Heat Wave, and then the old one, which is all, f no, the new one is called All Fired Up, and the old one is called Heat Wave. And there's a little bit of a difference in those. N not, in the, even like here in my eyes right now, they don't look very different to me. And then the last two are very similar also. This one is just a touch bluer. And I might have said this in the original video, but there, are, there were just barely a difference. So the new one is called So Chill, and the old one was called Blue Skies Ahead. So there you have it. I am going to retract my original statement. And, um, you know, these are different enough to where, you know, I don't feel like they... Um, cheated us or tried to dupe us, you know, into buying, you know, more polishes. So, you know, I, I just wanted to, since curiosity did get to me and I, I wanted to go back and, you know, clean up my statement. And um, I still do believe that these last ones are similar enough that, I mean, you really can't see much of a difference on them. But those other ones... You know, the, the getting warmer and the total meltdown and cool story. Those those three up here that were new are definitely, um, to me, and they were the ones that were in these bottles, you know, that, the kind of peachy pink and the purple and the fuchsia and the purple and the blue. These these definitely are unique enough that, you know, they're to me they're new. That's a new color. So... But that is all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed this update. And, um, you know, when I do catch myself misleading you, I, I, I want to make sure that I correct it. Um, I know a lot of you do listen to what I have to say about things. And um, if I make a mistake, I definitely want to clear that up. And this was a mistake. But by the swatch dots on the tops of these, you know, especially like these two, they look so very similar, but the, there is a slight difference. But then when you do it on the swatch wheel, it's more than a slight difference. It's it's a big difference. Let me turn these around. But it's a, it's a pretty big difference there. So there you have it, sports fans. I will see you next time. Until then, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon. Bye.